I bring in all the wishes and greetings on behalf of all the faculty members of Speed Medical Institute to Dr. Rishabh Bose for scoring a topmost rank uh, of rank number four in any SS 2022 session and AML rank of rank number nine uh, in the specialty of DM Gastroenterology. Congratulations to you, Doctor. Thank you so much, sir. So can we know a brief uh, background history of uh, Dr. Rishabh? Sure, sir. Uh, I did my MBBS from uh, Calcutta National Medical College, Kolkata. I did my MD from Ames Bhopal and uh, then I just finished my uh, MD this year in uh, January, end of January. I did a brief stint of SRship and I uh, uh, like left the job and studied for this exam and then I got this rank. Excellent, excellent. Now when did you start, how did you start and how many hours you spent for this, what all you did during the course of yes. the exam? Sir, I had uh, finished my MD uh, at, at the end of January. Okay. So I thought that I'll start uh, with my senior residency. I applied for it and I got it in my own institution. But I was having trouble uh, focusing solely on studies. I saw that the Speed app has a wonderful course prepared and which it takes up a lot of your time. But with jobs and doing the classes, it's very difficult. So I decided to... Uh, leave the job and just focus on studies. I spent uh, the, I think, uh, I think around, uh, I'll be very exact, 25 days. I did uh, just before the exams. I went through uh, Dheeraj sir's classes, all of the classes, be it INISS or the uh, general classes that were happening. And I did the MCQs that were there. And uh, I remember that I came out of the exam and I said, I, I didn't do very well. I thought that it was a very difficult paper. And, but I wanted to thank Dheeraj sir because I realized that there was a huge improvement uh, from the last time I gave the exam while I was doing my MD. So I said, sir, thank you. I know I don't, I don't know whether I'll be getting into it. I don't think so. But I want to thank you for the way you have prepared me. And sir asked me questions like, you know, uh, how many did you attempt? And I said, like, yeah, I have attempted uh, this amount, this number of questions. Sir said, you'll get in. So I said, okay, sir, I don't think so. <laughs> but thank you so much for the help. And then surprise, I got into the uh, uh, list for the next round. And then I gave the interview. And when I was logging into this Zoom meeting, I remembered my interview session. <laughs> it was butterfly in my stomachs and I knew that the whole AIMS department will be there looking at me. But it, it's nice for a change. Like I'm seeing one of my mentors here. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I got in and uh, I told sir and sir had told me that, yes, I told you so. <laughs> I did not believe sir previously, but Dheeraj sir is very good. <laughs> Excellent. Great. Uh, how was your interview? I mean, what were they asking? How it was? Yeah. Um, they asked me regarding a case. It was a long case. And uh, previously I had heard from various people that, you know, just because the whole pattern has shifted. So they had asked, I think, uh, long cases uh, previously also. So um, long cases, sir, Dheeraj Kumar sir had discussed with me discuss with us in the classes like what are the long cases uh, that could happen and thankfully uh, you know it, uh, the long case that i was uh, given was similar to what was discussed in class so again <laughs> thanks to sir we were given uh, lots of slides uh, so obviously the slides had varying difficulties some were simple some were more difficult and uh, basically it was not very difficult you just had to have the presence of mind and just go forward with it and uh, i think uh, it was okay i did not get, do very well in the interview but again like all these things were discussed somewhere or the other in the classes or the mcqs very nice very nice great experience now actually how many questions did you attend uh, out of 80 i attempted 79 excellent then that's the secret ah. Max, maximum push you give and uh, maximum possibility is the outcome uh, because I always feel that uh, just because there are so few seats, there is no use of playing safe. Either you make it or you don't make it. So even exactly. if you get wrong, that is that is the thing. 
So now I wanted I'm... to share something with you, sir. Please. Uh, uh, I told you that I I did my MBBS from uh, Calcutta National Medical College. My earliest memories of you were from that uh, institute. So I think I was in the second year and you had come uh, to talk about entrance examination preparations. Okay. Uh, so you had come there and I did not know. In Kolkata, at that point of time, coaching uh, for these uh, further specialities and super specialities was not uh, very big. Uh, so it was just starting and you were there to talk about it. I remember that you were asking questions and you were distributing prizes. Obviously, that was uh, fun. But the thing is that what, uh, you know, some people just hit you. Uh, you were some of those people, you know, this person is, you know, very influential. And, <laughs> and he is, is a very good orator and a very good teacher. Sadly, I have never been able to attend your class because I am in the medicine stream. But like I was, uh, you know, stuck by your personality. <laughs> <laughs> and I also remember the question you asked uh, and my senior got the prize. It was the uh, muscle with the longest name. I think it was <laughs> Adik Nezai. <laughs> Levator Leve Superioris yes. Alpha Nezai. Yes. <laughs> I think I, I gave 100 rupees price money, I believe so. 500 rupees. I still remember the amount. <laughs> <laughs> so you know it's a big thing to actually talk to you personally it's a big thing for me thank you sir <laughs> pleasure is mine pleasure is mine and meeting meeting you at a, a different stature and different achievement uh, that yeah. is uh, beautiful and um, so what is the message that you want to give to the juniors or aspirants of dm gastro sir i would want to say ki any uh, any uh, entrance exam is a tough battle it's a very tough battle and without guidance it's very difficult and speed has provided me with that guidance it's as simple as that without speed it would not have been possible honestly um, and i would like to mention one person dheeraj kumar sir uh, his classes you know even before uh, this i had i was doubtful like should i take gastro because after medicine you have so many specialties but i thought ki okay i'll take gastro I, and uh, during the classes he actually he said i'm going to make you interested in gastro and he actually did that he delivered on his promise <laughs> and the way he teaches na he, he, it gets into your brain and you understand okay. how things work you get a layout of the whole subject okay some people teach some people inspire also and obviously teach and he's uh, that person and i i really want to thank him the great, great. it will be conveyed this video will be uh, seen by him <laughs> and you'll feel very happy about it sure sir and i also feel like an elder brother to me even offline yeah, i used to call, uh, talk to him on message always guide me wonderful person <laughs> <laughs> very nice very nice of you and once again we wish you all thank the best you. and all the success as a great uh, gastroenterologist in the years to come keep going Thank keep you so inspiring much. us best wishes to you always thank you so much sir. thank you